Well, family and marriage are at the center of the Holy Father's trip to the United States this September. Today, couples seeking a happy, holy union face many challenges. Art and Lorraine Bennett are co-editors of Catholic and Married, Leaning into Love. It's published by our Sunday Visitor. So this is a book I know a lot of our viewers want to read. What are some of the challenges of marriage that are addressed in this? Well, Brian, uh, there's many challenges actually facing uh, couples today, especially young couples who, many of whom have parents who are divorced and um, they're wondering, you know, am I going to be able to make it in, in marriage? You know, so they're kind of like putting it off or postponing marriage or not getting married at all. And some of them are wondering whether cohabitation is the thing to do. And in this book, we talk, or the authors of all the different um, chapters talk about all these various things like being a child of divorce, cohabitation, contraception, um, the what is it like to marry young right out of college? So, so today's culture really is making it more difficult to be married, isn't it? I think it is, Brian. Uh, you know, there's two kind of pillars of, of, of Catholic families, uh, Christian point of view. One is that it's unitive, and I think the, uh, marriage is no longer seen as united with Christ or a product of, of, of God. It's harder for couples to get together, so unitive is kind of under attack. And then the, the uh, having children is also under attack, not just abortion and contraception, but just kind of the lifestyle we lead. Kids are too expensive and it's difficult. So I think those are two core areas of, of, of family life that are being attacked today. Yeah, marriage is tough. And unless it's a strong marriage, it really could run into trouble. How can couples strengthen their own marriage and how can we support married couples? Well, we, in our chapter, we do address, we're the old married couple of the, <laughs> of this book. Mature. But, yes, Mature, yes. <laughs> right. <laughs> but, um, yeah, we talk about um, three pillars of, the, of a healthy marriage. And it, we, we think that it's communication, forgiveness, and then the, most importantly, having the foundation in Christ, you know, the, the grace from the sacrament of marriage and the grace of ongoing participation in the sacraments. That is so key because couples think they're going to cohabitate to figure out mm -hmm. whether or not they actually get along. And, and when they do that, they don't have the grace of the sacrament mm -hmm. to right. strengthen them. Mm -hmm. That's right. So Sunday is Father's Day. Let's talk a little bit about how we can support men in the role that they play in the family and in the marriage. Mm -hmm. Well, I think men, men need to feel respected. Uh, men want to be loved, and, and that's really important. But if I think if a man feels respected, it doesn't mean you agree with everything that the, the, the husband's doing. That's vitally important. I think another key role that, that wives can play to help husbands is wives tend to be a little more, more social, a little bit more involved. So sometimes they can prod, and you know, has done this with me, to, well, you should need to talk to our oldest son, or why don't, you, why don't you come home a little earlier and make sure you make that ball game. So I think encouraging the interaction that is maybe not as natural for men helps us to be better fathers. How do you take that prodding, Art? I don't always like it. You don't <laughs> call it <laughs> nagging, though. I noticed that. <laughs> I don't. I've learned not to nag. <laughs> Prodding and nagging, I'm sure, are very different things, aren't well, they? Uh, Lorraine does it in a very yeah. diplomatic way, but I, I think women have a natural sense of the, of the community aspect of families, and sometimes we men were compartmentalizing, so it encourages us to be more involved, I think is a great gift. It is key for the, for the dad, the husband, to be in the middle of the mm -hmm. family, isn't it? That's, That's right. absolutely right. Yeah. Well, happy Father's Day to all the dads, Catholic and married, leaning into love from our Sunday visitor. You can find it at osv.com. Uh, we appreciate both of you being with us today. Thank the Bennetts, you. thanks so much. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. Thank you. God bless you.